Hey, what is up guys? I hope this will work. I'll try to go pretty quick with it. The issue is when I connect using the header pins of the Raspberry Pi connected via OctoPrint, I connect initially, but then when I disconnect and then try to reconnect, I have been running into issues. So I have reconnection issues when connecting to the board after an initial disconnect. And I have to reboot the entire Pi to connect. I set up OctoPrint a while ago. Got that going. I have it going on a Raspberry Pi 3B. I have the GPIO pins hooked up to a Big Tree Tech SKR version 1.3, disconnected my TFT 35 version 2, and hooked up the Pi uh, GPIO pins to the uh, TFT pins. So there's a total of five pins. There's a total of three pins, excuse me. So I'm also powering the Pi from the board as well. So I have a 5 volt pin powering the Pi, and then I have a ground going to the ground pin on the Pi as well, and that's fine. And then I have the RX and TX pin going to the TFT port on the Pi. And when you set up the Pi, I have Bluetooth disabled, but for whatever reason, on the Pi's 3 and greater from reading this article, he says that this is going to be the hardware serial port on the Pi, and I believe it is. Even and I went through, and I even disabled the uh, the console, and I believe I disabled the I put uh, disabled that instead of enabling that. So I just disabled Bluetooth altogether. And then if I do sudo vim boot, I think it's the config. You can see all the way down here. I have enabled UART. And then I have DT overlay, and that these are my little notes right here. Um, so I had a Bluetooth disabled, so there should be no Bluetooth going at all, and it should just be the hardware. Uh, should just be the hardware um, RXTX going, the hardware UART RXTX going over the serial comp because I have that disabled, and so the mat on the Pi, this guy says it should be this dev. TTTYS0, if I'm not mistaken. This is by far the best write up. So, with that, serial zero, let's go back to our terminal, LDEV. Serial zero is going to TTYS0, and it's owned by root root. Serial zero, let's go down to find this TTY guy, and you can see it's owned by root dialout. I am in the group, dial out group right there. This is a symlink to the S0, the TTTY S0. I set my baud rate to 115200, 115200, or you could say, I say 115200, it's easier for me, or you could say 111, <laughs> or you could say 115200. I like 115200, whatever. Tomato, tomato. That is my hardware port right there. And I have that hooked up as well. And I got this serial port too. And then I got the baud rate right there. So got all that. This is the physical USB port on the on the SKR. This is the uh, the screen port, the TFT. And that is, is remember, this is a symlink to this. And that's just the USB. And that's it. Kind of dial those back a little bit. And you can, and depending on how you have your Marlin configured on your board, you either generally go with this or you go with that. That TFT port I'm talking about is right there. I'm moving my mouse over. Interesting though, because for future, on the, what I'll do, do down the road is I want to hook my screen up to this. And if you look, how it says 5 volts, ground, TX, RX. That is the same exact thing except this is our TFT. TFT operates at 3.5 volts. 5 volt logic, but then this aux port works at 5 volt logic, like you see right there. I'm hooked into here, right here, and I got my the transmission pin of the Pi going to the RX pin and the TX pin of this of the board going to the RX pin. You flip flop those TX, RX, RX, TX, ground voltage. Got all that going, and I should be able to connect. And let me get over the terminal, clear this out. Boom. Here is the issue I'm having. I am connected to the SKR version 1.3, Big Tree Tech. Okay, so I'll issue a command. You should get some feedback from it. I just literally just compiled this earlier today. And then we'll clear it out again just to make sure everything's working as it should. Pull that data back from the from the board printer, if you will. When I'm in, when I'm connected to the Pi using the UART pins of the GPIO. Here we go here. Yeah, here we go. So on my Pi, I'm using this pin, this pin, and this pin, and I'm using the, one of these. These are both five volts, so I'm powering the Pi with that. In the in this ground, so that's five volt, five volt ground, 
That's the TX. That's the RX. I remember this by saying GTR. Ground, transmit, receive. There's a GTR. Easy way to remember that. So, Octo print. I'm connected. And I'm running into with that. And to connect. So do that. And you see, I run into these issues. My settings. Hit the serial. There's my ports. I don't really need any additional ports. Or, yeah, don't need any additional ports other than those. So I'm not going to use the AMA port. Because that's for older generations older generation of pots. Um, as you saw, all these settings, I haven't changed them since I disconnected, and I even put this to always, and it's still coming up with these kind of issues right here. Do that, so close. If I were to restart this pot, or, or, so the pie is getting power from the printer, I have to cut the power to the printer, turn it back on, and then I'll be able to reconnect. I haven't tried rebooting the board, so I'll try to do that. We just rebooted the board. It's about five seconds to boot up. If that if it's board related or if it's pie related, because I just reboot the reboot the uh, the board, the SKR board. I think it could be pie related and how it's holding on to the interface of those pins on the GPIO uh, breakout, if you will. I think whatever for whatever reason the Raspbian and an octo print are grabbing that and they're not releasing it, so when it tries to re reconnect, it's holding on to that prior connection somehow. Or to take just take a shot in the dark. So let's try this. Yeah, see, the question is, how can I disconnect through this interface and then close out that connection maybe manually through the terminal if need be? If I could reconnect and disconnect at my leisure without having to turn off the whole pot. Any thoughts on that would be greatly appreciated. Thank you.